hello everyone in this video we will discuss about solution for question number 14 that was asked in k2023 in electrical engineering here the question is uh, an 8 bit ADC converts analog voltage in the range of 0 to 4 plus 5 volt to the corresponding digital code as per the conversion characteristics shown in figure for V in equal to 1.9 to 2 volt, which of the following digital output given in H is true. <coughs> so, uh, we are given a V input as 1.9 and double 2 volt, and we have to find its corresponding uh, digital output of this 8 bit uh, analog digital converter in H. So we will see how we can find the answer. So in the graph we are given the x axis we are given the digital output and the y axis we are given the analog input voltage. So since this is a digital output is digital it will be like a step values not like a continuous value analog it will be continuous suppose if this is analog this is analog this will be the its uh, corresponding digital digital output so in this question first of all we have to find the resolution of the ATC what I mean the resolution means is the uh, changing input or analog voltage is needed? You can see changing input and analog voltage is needed, needed to change the digital output by one unit. Suppose here you can see from here to from this level to this level. If you want to change the digital output from this level to this level, we need this much of uh, analog in voltage. So this is the resolution here so that is our resolution so resolution actually we can find using this equation that is full scale output voltage divided by 2 raised to n minus 1 where n is the I can see here it's, uh, n is the number of bit here it is 8 so this is the equation for finding the resolution and resolution is actually same as the least significant bit that is equal to less. So here, uh, full scale voltage uh, output voltage we need. So in the question, it is given as five volt, zero to five volt. So this is the full scale output voltage, and it's an eight bit ADC. So we can find its resolution using this equation. So it will be five by two raised to n minus one. That is five by two to two hundred fifty five. That is ninety point six millivolt. So this is our step size. So for each 19.6 millivolt change in input voltage, the digital output will change by one unit, like this. So suppose we are here, we have to or uh, we have to change the digital output to this level. So we have to change the analog input voltage by 19.6 millivolt. So this is the definition of this uh, resolution. That means that when the input voltage changed by 19.6 millivolt, the output digital value will change by one unit. So that is the uh, resolution of this analog to digital converter. So now uh, in the question. Uh, so basically the characteristics of a, uh, this kind of converter that is having a 90.6 uh, LSP or 90.6 millivolt resolution the characteristics will be like this it will start from 0 and when 90.6 millivolt is reached it will change it change to 1 unit and next 
when it reaches 30.2 that is two times this uh, 90.6 it will change this to one unit digital output will change by one unit and it will be like this a step value but here in the question this curve is little bit shifted this is shifted to around this area because in the question you can see is starting from 9.8 not from 19.6 actually in, uh, if, if there is no shifting happen it should start from 19.6 but here in, in this case there was a small shift so this will start from 9.8 so this shift will be there for the entire uh, curve so it is shifted up to 9.8 this also will be in between and in uh, this also will be shifted so we have to consider this curve this is the curve when there is no shifting happen so because uh, this output will change whenever it reaches one lsp or one resolution but here it is changing when it is reaching at 9.8 so that means this curve is shifted to the left and that is the curve that is given the question so it is shifted by 9.8 millivolt. You can see it is 9.8.6 here when it is changing. Output state is changing, but here it is 9.8. So it is shifted by 9.8 millivolt. That means 0.5 LSP because our one LSP is 9.8.6, and its half is 9.8 millivolt. So it is shifted by 0.5 LSP. So we have to find. Uh, the output voltage in terms of x value for the given input voltage using this curve. So let's see how we can proceed. So for the first curve, that is when there is no shifting happen. Suppose for this for this curve, when the input voltage is zero, in between zero and 19.6, the output state is zero h. Let's see. Zero, not uh, zero. You can see here. But it, if it is between one LSP and two LSP, its value is one. There is one uh, step happen. One. So its value is one. Similarly, if it is between two LSP and three LSP, you can see if it is between two LSP. This is 2 LSP and 3 LSP. So its value is here in between these two, its value is 2. For curve 2, the condition is different, little bit different. Between 0 and 0 0.5 LSP, between 0, this is 0, and 0 0.5 LSP, the output is 0 here. So output is 0. But between, let's go back to the diagram again. But between this 0.5 LSP to this width is 19.6. That is one LSP. So between 0.5 LSP to 1.5 LSP, output is one. Between 0 0.5 LSP to 1.5 LSP it is 1. Similarly, between 1.5 LSP to 2.5 LSP, output is 2. So, according to this, the number of steps will change. So, when the, it is between this range, it is between 1.5 LSP to 2.5 LSP, there are two steps happen. So, in the question, the input voltage is 1.9922. This is the input voltage. So suppose we say that x times happen, x steps have happened. So x into L S P equal to 1.9922. From here we can find x that is equal to 1 1.9922 divided by 9.6 millivolt. That is equal to 101.64. So, if you are going like this, we can tell that between 1.5 1 LSP 
negative 102.5 LSP. And V input is in between this. If V input is in between 101.5 LSP and 102.5 LSP, or we can look at this figure. Here this one between 1.5 LSP and 2.5 LSP. Then the number of steps happened is 2. Similarly, here this V in equal to 1.164 LSP. Actually, this V in equal to this is equal to 101.64 LSP. So, this is will fall in between 105.5 LSP and 102.5 LSP. So, in this between in, in this range, the number of steps happened will be 102. Here you can see if it is less than 2.5, it is 2. If it is less than 1.5, it is 1. If it is less than 0 0.5, it is 0. 0 steps. Similarly, if it is less than 102.5, the number of ste steps will be 102. So this number of steps means it is indecimal. So in the question, we have to find the hexadecimal, hexadecimal value. So 102 in decimal means 66 in a hexadecimal. So the answer is 66 in, uh, H. So option C is the correct answer. Here. So that's all about the answer. If you, are, if you want to know more about this analog digital computers, you can refer to this lecture. So that's all about the answer. Thank you all.